After the storm, bus riders forced to walk in the streets and dangerously close to cars. Bus stops still covered in snow, and this is a problem CBS2 has covered before. CBS News' Alana Gold is live in Clifton, New Jersey, to show us what they are dealing with this morning. Alana. Mary, good morning. I'm going to wait for this car to go by. Actually, there's one more. Hold on. Just one more second. People here in Clifton tell us it's only a matter of time before someone gets hurt, and this is why. Check out the sidewalk that they have to walk on to get to the bus stop. You can see how deep the snow is. You just sink right in. In some spots, it's also icy. It's slippery, easy to fall. People aren't walking on this at all. They're actually going right on the highway, and they're getting very close to fast-moving traffic. Take a look at what commuters have to deal with at the New Jersey Transit bus stop off the busy Route 3 West at Main Avenue in Clifton. The path here unshoveled and uncleared four days after the blizzard. This is really, it's very dangerous, it's scary. Riders have no choice but to walk in the street just inches away from cars going by. We have to just make sure that the buses and the cars don't run over us. And a bus and a bicyclist almost hit each other trying to avoid all the people. It's a mess. Because their other option is trekking through these piles of snow, getting to and from the bus stop, something many refuse to do. It's better than hiking through this. It's all soaking wet and it's cold and it's dangerous. The pathways at the bus stop on Route 3 and Passaic Avenue in Clifton also buried in snow. And a viewer in Garden City on Long Island sent us this picture of their bus stop. The scene here, not much better. It's a grim reminder of last year when we first reported this problem in the tri state area. It's easy to see that not much has changed. It's just the same thing over and over every year. Commuters are beyond frustrated. They want to know why they're dealing with the same issue this winter and why plows haven't showed up. So I understand they have a lot of things to do. Uh, meanwhile, we would love to them to make our priority. Clifton City Manager Dominic Villano says crews have been busy plowing the main roads and schools after the storm, but admits these walkways should have been cleared on Sunday. People who ride the bus now demanding action before someone possibly gets hurt. So a big mess to clean up. The city manager here in Clifton says the storm was so intense that it's really taken a toll on all of the resources. The crews are absolutely exhausted, as you can imagine. But he assured us that these walkways will get cleared today. We're live in Clifton, New Jersey this morning. Ilana Gold, CBS 2 News.